Uh, hey everybody, just wanted to spend a little bit of time going over question 21.10. Um, this question is kind of a, I would guess, a more straightforward of the questions, um, but I think it bears a little bit of time going over just because, remember, nuclear chemistry is the chemistry of the, of how the um, nucleus breaks down, and the nucleus is made up of protons and neutrons. So maybe some of our basics about how to determine number of protons and neutrons from an atomic symbol, from a nuclide symbol, or from the word written out may, may help us. Um, so anyways, let's look at iodine. So for A, um, remember the number of protons is equal to the atomic number. In the nuclide symbol, the atomic number is that number in the lower left-hand corner, and in this case it's 53. Now the number of neutrons is related to the mass number, but it's the number of protons plus the number of neutrons equals this. So that when we do that 129 to get the number of neutrons we're just going to subtract here so that's 129 minus 53 okay we're going to take 53 from 129 and I think that that's going to be 76 okay the way that I'll check is it just a check I'll just add these up and that's 129 check that's the mass number and that's what we have here okay so now for barium it says barium 138 but bari barium in order to do this, we have to know that it's atomic number 56. Now, you have a periodic table. You can look at it, okay? And so the number of protons, again, fairly straightforward, okay, 56. Look at it right on the periodic table. Now, the number of neutrons is 56 plus something gives us 138, okay? Or 138 minus 56. And so we do that in our head, and we get 82. Okay, and now for C, Neptunium, again, we need to look up what the atomic number is. So when we look in the periodic table, Neptunium is NP, okay? So Neptunium's number of protons is 93. Let me double check. Yes, 93. Okay, and now 93 protons, and then protons plus neutrons gives us this mass here, 237, and so that mass must be, and I'm doing this in my head, let's see, for 144, okay? So, <coughs> excuse me, um, so it's always good to remember some of the, um, some of the um, beginning things when it deals with nuclear chemistry, um, so have a great time with that.